Hi, and welcome to Getting Started with Tana. Everything in Tana is connected in a knowledge graph so you can easily find and extract exactly what you're looking for. With super tags, text can be turned into real objects, so your meeting note is connected to customers, people, and projects in your meeting. These objects flow to where they're useful. Tasks, bugs, and follow-ups from your meeting automatically flows to the processes they have so you can stay on top of everything. Tana is as simple to use as a text editor. Simply type like you're used to, but notice that each line has a bullet on it. We call this a node. A node is a powerful concept, but for now, just think of them like magical bullets. And just like a bulleted list, you can write multiple nodes after one another, and you can indent using the tab key or outdent using shift tab. You can also reorganize nodes using the keyboard or drag them with the mouse. Nodes can be expanded and collapsed, and you can even zoom into node at any level. And when you click the back button, you're back to where you started. Super tags turns text into real objects. They work just like normal tags, so you can connect the information just by adding a tag, but they're far more powerful than that. Think of them as templates or tables in a database to build objects like persons, companies, and anything you can imagine without having to know anything about databases. Clicking on a tag lets you find every node with the same tag, or you can configure the tag and create a template-like structure. More about that in a video about super tags. Nodes can be viewed in different ways. You can use, for instance, a table to get a quick overview and manipulate many nodes at the same time. They can also be viewed as cards, so you can manage your information like in a Kanban setup, and there are many more views to come. Nodes can also be opened in new panels, so you can work on multiple things at the same time. On your left, you have your sidebar. This is a list of all the nodes that live at the very top of your workspace. The sidebar can be edited by clicking your avatar to open your home area. You can add nodes directly into your home area, or you can drag any node to your sidebar for convenient access. You can use the sidebar to navigate your graph, but it's much easier to find stuff using the search bar. In the very top right, you'll find the Help Center. Here you can find videos and articles about how you get the most out of Tana. The first thing that greets you in Tana is the Today node. You can also click the Today icon in the top bar to access this. Every day has a My Day tag so you can get a custom templates for all your days. Check out the video on day-to-day -day work in Tana to learn how to set it up and automate your day. We've also included a to-do tag so you can tag any task you need to get done and easily keep track of them by clicking on the today search in the sidebar. This shows you all your to-dos that are not yet completed. If you're working on something deep in your graph, you can click quick add to add any information without moving away from where you're working. What you add here ends up in your Today node and in any flow that is set up to listen for nodes that match. Another way to connect information is to link it using our at dialog. If you want to create a shortcut to a node, simply type at and search for the node that you're looking for. You can even do that inside of a text, so you create an inline link to the node. When you zoom into a node, you get an overview everywhere this node is mentioned or linked. You can even mention dates and persons using the at dialog. You can also create new nodes using the at dialog. Use this to create links to objects that doesn't yet exist. These nodes end up in the library, a collection of everything that doesn't live anywhere specific in your graph. So where should you put things? Generally, it works best if you follow these guidelines. Today is where you put the day-to-day -day information. Many use it to create all of their content since Tana objects can flow to where they're useful. Your home node and sidebar is useful for organizing things that have a natural tree structure and to put shortcuts for things that you want quick access to. The library is used for things that are created on the fly and are object-like, like the people, companies, cities, and so on. To illustrate, take this example of how to organize books. In your Today node, you can add a to-do about buying a specific book. By at mentioning that book, you create a book object in the library. And in your home area, and therefore the sidebar, is where you typically would create the search for all the books that you want to buy. To get the full Tana experience, we suggest you download our Chrome app simply by clicking the Download button in the Location bar in Chrome. 
This makes it easier to use Tana every day. Learning Tana takes a bit of effort, but once you do, you'll be working faster than ever before. A good next step is to watch the videos linked below and sign up to our Slack community where you can get help and inspiration from us and others in our vibrant community. Until next time, take care and we'll see you in the next video.